Most augmented reality experiences are short 10, 15 second experiences. So like, what does a 70 year AR experience even look like? You could have somebody's life play out in real time and have all these things changing. That idea grew into the house. When you look at it, it's like, like you've never seen anything like that before, and it's magic. I'm always moving around when I'm in that flow state. I don't want to feel slowed down. Having a device that can be unplugged and working helps the whole creation process. When I'm creating a piece of artwork, I'm scanning a lot of 3D models. I'm taking these flowers specifically and I'm gonna put them on the front of the house. If I'm making a piece and, and I get struck with inspiration, I need to strike while the iron's hot. When I think about the moments that put a smile on my face, it's the smaller everyday moments. And with the house, I wanted to make a, a piece about Steph, my partner. It's about love, human connection. Every time you hold your phone up to it, something changes. At night, they're gonna be asleep. They might be dancing in the kitchen, watching TV. They grow in real time. I'm using a Snapdragon processor to work at the maximum power. It is crazy to me. The tech is allowing me to create experiences for the last 70 years. I don't really want you to think about the technology and what's happening. I just want you to look at something and then just before your eyes, it's just happening and it's magic. Augmented reality is the perfect metaphor for modern day life because you spend half your time in the physical world and you spend half your time in the digital world. It's rewriting the boundaries of what art is, where you can create a 70 year piece of artwork and it feels alive. I don't see any limitations how my art can present itself and Snapdragon allows me to deliver experiences that people have never had before. Sponsored by Snapdragon.